Happy Tuesday, Northeast Kansas. I'm KSNT News, Storm Track, meteorologist Kyle Borkett, and this is your midday web weather update. Some more cloud cover around today compared to what we saw just 24 hours ago, but generally speaking, will be partly sunny with high temperatures battling back into the middle and upper 60s. Our average high is only 58. South winds helping our high temperatures become as warm as they will be this afternoon, gusting as high as 30 miles per hour at times. Tomorrow, of course, is Veterans Day, tracking that cloud cover to win out by tonight. This is Future Track at midnight with overcast skies. Tomorrow, a very windy day. West and northwesterly winds as high as 45 miles per hour at times. We can thank the cold front for that. But before it moves through, even prior to dawn, tomorrow, 5 or 6 o'clock, some scattered showers across our eastern counties and maybe along and north of US 36. Otherwise, we're dry, especially after lunchtime. Right now, the severe weather threat actually looms only to the east into Missouri. In fact, the large majority of Northeast Kansas will not even see a thunderstorm tomorrow. I'm going to advance it one more frame or so until 4 o'clock. You can see some precipitation uh, falling with this computer model up in north central Kansas between Concordia and Belleville in Cloud and Republic counties. Of course, we're tracking a cold front. This is actually rain wrapping back in behind the front and maybe, just maybe, we can get some cold enough air into north central Kansas that some of that chilly rain will start to turn over into wet snowflakes as early as tomorrow afternoon into the early evening hours. Not expecting any accumulation, but certainly reminds us that winter might might not be so far away. Storm Track Chief Meteorologist Matt Miller, he's live at 5 tonight. He'll run the new computer models and we'll see what they have to say for tomorrow, but it really does look like the severe weather threat is moot. I'll join you guys tomorrow morning at 4.30 with the latest for Veterans Day. Have a great Tuesday.